Sur la glace, représentant le Canada. On the ice, representing Canada, Kathleen Osmond. Next out onto the ice here at Grand Prix Final, a woman who's already had a great start to her season, 21-year-old Caitlin Osmond of Canada, the first ladies competitor from her country to qualify for the final since 2009. Now, in complete contrast to Satoko Mihara, look at the power as she goes into this triple flip, triple toe. Just massive. She got her free side a little far behind her on the flip and then did a textbook perfect triple toe on the end. Right into the footwork, triple lutz. Just spectacular. Caitlin kicked things off this fall by winning a silver medal on home ice at Skate Canada, her second career Grand Prix medal, and then another in China just a few weeks later. You have to imagine a huge boost of confidence for her, and you can see it in the way she's selling this program right now. Double axle, just perfect. So important not to overlook the easy pass after you get through those two difficult jumping passes. From Edmonton, Alberta, Caitlin Osmond. Powerful, charismatic, completely unstoppable in this short program, Ryan. Just wow. I can't imagine what anyone else could do in this event that would be more impressive than that. She flew through all three jumping passes. She commanded the audience from start to finish. She spun well. She just did everything. Obviously, those two jumping passes were right at the beginning of the program. So when you're going head to head against Yevgenia Medvedeva, those passes of hers will get an extra 10%. But wow, just I don't even know if I could think of any of the guys in the men's discipline that could power through these jumping passes and it's like the this. speed, too. I haven't seen speed like that since the new judging system was instated. It's really a throwback to the kind of speed we used to see before there were transitions into jumps. She's flying around the rink. And she's flying around the rink with transitions. And the way she comes out of the air is textbook. Nothing changes. It almost seems like she's got an assist and someone's just gently placing them off, placing her on the ice after each of these passes. But wow. What a statement with the world champion still to come. This is going to be a huge number. And 
I, at the beginning of this season, never would have thought of her as a favorite to win the world championships. But man, she is making her mark. Well, she earned her highest scores to date in the short program at Skate Canada this fall, and that blows it out of the water. 75.54, a season's best for Caitlin Osmond from Canada, currently in first place. Just four athletes remain in the short program, all from Russia. Maria Sutskova, Anna Pogorelaya, Elena Radionova, and Evgenia Medvedeva. The four teens will start their hunt for gold and look to represent Russia in winning fashion.